So I have decided um, to put a new uh, vacuum check valve on my truck now. Um, the reason why I decided this because I try to adjust mine and uh, even though the vacuum was great and all that I, I wasn't sure if it was staying true to the to what I was adjusting it so I decided to buy this one This is from uh, Larry Cobbs, um, and it's a check valve. When I placed the order, I basically told them what I had, a 22 horsepower with a 45 blower, etc. And, uh, and they'll send you the valve. It looks great. Uh, so I'll be putting this up there. Even though I seen most of, um, for example, cops, um, Larry Cops truck mounts, they put the valve close to the blower, but mine is all the way in the tank, and I am going to keep it that way for now and see how it runs like that. So stay tuned. I'll show you. This is an easy, easy fix. I'll show you in a minute how uh, I put it on. Stay tuned. So this is what my valve looks like. It's also made out of copper. Um, and again, I don't know if, uh, if I, I was adjusting it wrong or whatever, but with this one here, it's a for sure thing. So I'm just gonna get it on there. All right, step two. I don't know if you can see that, but when you install these things, the air goes like this. All right, so basically, that's the outside. This is going into the tank. That's all there is to it. I gotta put back in the tank, and that's all there is. I don't have to worry about the check line. So you can see the difference. So I'm hoping at the end of the day I get better suction to stay out of the so all right okay all done that's what it looks like um pretty much the same concept all but i really wanted a new one uh, this one seen better days but it's pretty much the same concept that there and
that from crop supply. All right. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. God bless. Bye-bye.